So let's take a little break from the music for a second and watch this video. Uh, I would say he's a comedian. He may not be officially a comedian, but he definitely has the skills to be like a stand-up comedian. Um, he's a YouTuber named Zach Rushing. And I would say his two most famous videos are, uh, his most famous video probably is, uh, how do I describe this? <laughs> He's a country, he's a country guy. He's a white, he's a white guy. And he has a lot of black friends, I guess, and stuff. And he went to a barbecue, which was mostly black people. And he said that it was uh, quite an experience um, like he's never had before. And uh, his videos are just him, like usually in a, in a, car like a truck and he's driving and he's just talking and it sounds like a full-on like stand-up bit you know like just a full-on like he could be a stand-up comedian or something it's so hilarious and his videos are just so casual it's just him like sitting in his car most of the time just talking ranting raving cussing and, <laughs> and griping about stuff and it's hilarious. I've already seen the one about the barbecue, so I can't really react to that. A lot of people react to that. It's a common thing that people react to on YouTube. And there's another one where he goes to a fish fry. Um, Mama T's fish fry or something. And it's hilarious. And then he has a bunch of other videos. I've seen a few here and there. I thought I'd re react to... One that I haven't seen before, and I have no idea what it's about. Uh, well, this one is called, I did what she asked. I just did it my way. Which I'm guessing, in the context of it, it's something to do with his wife or girlfriend or something. Like, he did what she asked, but he did it his way. Which I'm guessing was not the way that she wanted it to be done. So, let's see what that's about. I'm curious to know what she asked him to do and what he did. That was probably way off. It's official that I cannot do anything right. I still don't understand how I'm in trouble for this. Women, if you give your man a task to do something, you cannot get mad at him in the root that he takes to get the task done. As long as he gets the task done, that's got to be the end of it. That's got you got to just be proud of it. So let me tell y'all what's done happened today. Well, it won't stand up. About a week ago, the little Sarah Bear, she tells me she goes, Zach, we got some flies that's really starting to get bad because it's we in South Mississippi flies. and it rains every other day. It's oh. two rats fucking in a wool sock down here. There's gonna be flies. I can't help it. But anyway, she tells me, she says Zach, the flies is getting bad. I, they keep on coming in the house. I want you to render this. I said, all right, baby, I'm on Render it. I, this. Give me, give me some, a fly left in this son of a bitch. Now, that was three days ago, thanks to Amazon Prime. Amazon now, Prime. She woke up this morning to go to the gym. She had to go to the gym. She had to go to the grocery store to get some fiddles, and then she was coming home. I saw this as the opportune time that the house was going to be inhabitable. It was, Nobody was going to be in there besides me. So it was my time to stage war on these flies. Now, I had done my preparations. I had laid out... My I think I know exactly what he's talking about. I think I know where he's going with this because uh, we have them in our house as well. So, <laughs> my dad has one. I bought it for him for Christmas. My camo. I had painted my face. Yeah. I had done taken all of the pillows off of the couches and built me a blind right next to the coffee table. That's all revolving around the fact of what come in through the Amazon Prime, which just so happens to be this salt gun right here that I have nicknamed the Bug Buster 2000. It is a gun that you put regular <laughs> table salt in, you cock it, and you shoot it. Yep, that's the exact same one that my dad has. The Blood Buster 3000. Okay. There's not much to a fly, so there's not much blood busting, but, you know, 
and it's basically like deer hunting, but you're hunting flies because it's like shooting a fly with shotgun. Now, I am laying there in the living room. I have done planted my plot in the middle of the living room because I got seven foot reach on this side. <laughs> Why do you? Have here. I'm talking about it gets up there and touch shit. Now, camouflage. I am laying there just like Chris Kyle on my sniper rifle, just like that right yonder. And I have planted me a damn bowl of wet Alpo dog food right in the middle of the living room. And to tell y'all that I am busting their ass is an understatement. Like, I'm way past my was... limit on flies today. Like, I'm way into, gun, into game warden territory. <laughs> and then I hear the door open. Now, I knew you can't, one thing you can't do, you can't disturb somebody's hunting hey. area while they in there hunting. So I knew the hunting was over with. So I come out of my fort that I had built out of the couch cushions. And what I see... Is a five foot four inch, hundred and thirty pound mad ass white woman. Cause all of a sudden she done figured out that I didn't render the fly problem the way that she wanted me to render the fly problem. I rendered the fly problem the man way. I figured out some kind of way that I could shoot them some bitches, and that's exactly what I did. And there's no more flies in the house, but she's not happy about that. Now that house, I might have went a little bit overboard because I went through three tins of Morton salt. Because I was blasting their ass, and if I didn't get them on the first shot, that thing's a pump action, and I was going to town on it. So I went through a little bit too much salt. But I can tell y'all one thing, that house in there in that living room is not the only thing that's salty in there right now. Because that woman is mad as hell. She's going to look how at me and say, Zach, how are we going to get have? all this salt up? My God. There's no way he went through three things of Morton salt. There's no way. But I'm totally with him. I mean, what's wrong with that? I'm guessing she's going to be mad because there's salt all over the place. But, I mean, we shoot the, that thing all the time and we don't really notice any, I mean, I'm sure there's a little flex of salt here and there, but it's not like you would imagine it would be, unless he was just going insane. <laughs> it's pretty cool, actually, <laughs> those little salt guns. They're pretty cool. I bought you a $900 Roomba. That's what that son of a bitch does. That's all he wants to do is go around and suck up shit. She wouldn't even let me wash my face. She's like, get out, get out, get out. I'm out. I'm out, son. I'm cooling off in this truck for a second, but I got one tin of salt left. And you think. Wow. Okay. I, I agree. He bought you a Roomba. The Roomba should get the job done or else it's a piece of crap. <laughs> I'm fitting to go around here busting some flies asses outside. I can find something to do. You ain't going to keep me down. You ain't going to dim my shine. Shit. He's so funny. He's hilarious. <clears throat> but yeah. <laughs> I bought I bought my dad that same um exact salt gun. I saw it randomly on Amazon. And I was like, uh is he going to think this is stupid? Like is he not going to like this at all? Um, cause he's the hardest person to buy for ever. He like has everything and I'm always struggling to, to get him presents. And I was like, I feel like he might like this, but he also might think it's really stupid, but I did good buying it and he seems to like it and he walks around the house like Rambo trying to kill flies so I haven't used it myself but it looks pretty cool actually I mean either you're walking around swatting at stuff with the fly swatter or you're shooting a gun at it I mean what's cooler sure you get a fleck of salt here and there but who cares there's already dust all over the house anyways. I'll try to find some more Zach Rushing clips to react to in the future that I haven't seen, but it's hard to find ones that I haven't seen that are it's funny. I also watched the one where his uh, nephew got in trouble by the teacher because he wasn't doing he wasn't showing his work on math homework and they were doing that new math and 
he was getting all mad about that because he's like, I helped him with his homework and we did it right. And she still marked it wrong, even though the answers were correct, because she said he didn't show his work pr appropriately. And it, it's like a two part video of him ranting and raving, claiming that he went down there and chewed out the teacher. I don't know if he really did or not, but it's still hilarious. Uh, I totally agree with him on that one, too, to be honest. Maybe it's just from where we're from. <laughs> I'm on the same wavelength as him. Um, but yeah. See you later. Alligator. <laughs>